bit where your wife is in the middle. That's the YouTube logo, what I'm on, obviously. Oh, right. That's YouTube, yeah. Oh. All right, Dad. Yeah, boys, we've, uh, we're over the £500 target we are already uh, with this charity thing. So thank you very much. I've got a few people to thank because you've all done fucking excellent adding money to this charity. Thank you very much. Uh, Sasha, Sasha said, uh, sorry, it's not much. Hey, mate, fucking hell, every little helps. It doesn't matter about the amount, really. Obviously, every little bit helps. If we all put a little towards it, we'll, we'll get the money right up, won't we? Uh, Paul Nielsen, thank you. Alan Beattie, Gordon Cromwell, Logger Darren, Andy Koresh. I don't know whether it is Koresh. It's from the Isle of Man, anyway. Cheers, Andy. Uh, Alan Jackman, Di, Brian Andrews, Phil, Ian Law, uh, Shane from uh, Airtronic Transmissions, ah, Shane. Thank you, Shane. Robert Jackson, uh, wish you and your family all the best as well, Robert, thank you. Uh, Nick the Accountant, cheers, Nick. Ah, Nick's there, look as well, he's even put some money towards it. Woody, our Uncle Phil, thank you, Phil. Nick AF, Matt, Gary Beard, Mark Jackson and David Wood. All of you, thank you very much. You fucking top men, you've done well. You've contributed to a good cause. Thank you, lads. Much obliged. Another good news today. Got me merch, look. Opened it last night. I won't chuff with it. It's good quality. It's thick, isn't it? It's nice. Got it on here and on my back I have. So I'm rocking the merch. I bought two of them because I bought one for the old chap today as well. He really ought to have retired struggler because he's 65, but he's still not retired, so he's still a professional struggler. <laughs> Arrow man spotted him. The other said, Oh, you've got your top set. I said, yeah, go on last night, Dad. He said, I want one. I said, what do you want? Do you want retired struggler or do you want professional struggler? He said, well, I'm, I'm still really working, ain't I? He said, do you do a semi-retired struggler? I said, no, 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 no. <laughs> Damn it. Someone always wants something different, don't they? This is a trouble. You can't go out your own yard sometimes. You can't for doing jobs. Our dad's dragging these uh, cars out now. Get the fault lift on it. Yeah, we've got a conversation. I think that's all lift here. Oh, my girl's here, look, with nannies. It's a bloody deep, isn't it? Yeah. Alright, my girl. Cold, isn't it? Where are you going, it? charity shop, Mum? No, no, they're uh, safe, Bruce. Oh, right. Would we'll get an advertiser. Oh, good, She's a lick of boo tape. Hey, Mum, we broke over the 500 mark of that charity. Oh, yeah, yeah. Already? Yeah, we're there now. 535, we're on. Ah, good. Let's get cracked up. Oh, and boys, another good news and all. While I'm sat here waiting at these train lines, we've got some good news today, haven't we? We're full of good news. We've peaked the 500 mark. I've got my merch and I'm over 9K subscribers. <laughs> Can you believe it? Because I can't. Hey, before Christmas, I had a few hundred. Now, I've got 9,000 subscribers. Yahoo! Hey, roll on the 10K, boys. Are you not oh, yeah, retired yet? Yeah. Brilliant, isn't it? Hey, you're not allowed to retire now. No, now, not now you've got the professional I'm, one. I'm you, mate. You know, Roy. No, that's it. No. Right, get in this. I'm just going to get in uh, a trailer. Why is that beeping so much? What's up with it? There we go. Just going to get it. Stop it. I'm just going to get in a trailer to do uh, do some pads on it. I did them. The one side, fuck about two weeks ago, I thought another lad had done them, fin uh, finished this job off, but he hasn't. So I'm going to go to now and uh, and change the discs and pads on the near side now. Got three discs and pads to change. Let's get fuck. For fuck's sake. Nobody fills the fucking shunter up with diesel. What's the fucking crack, Jack? I'm gonna have to diesel this cunt up now. Look, I'm gonna have to rev it up. There's fuck all air in it. It's got piss all fuel in it, though. Nobody can be asked to do fuck all, can they? Hey, we're moving. Get there quick, that's what I say. This shunter, though, is good. It's got like a pre warning system where it'll. it'll. Uh, it'll run out and then it gives you another attempt. 
because it strikes up again for a few minutes, which is good. Uh, which one we're on? We're on the other side. We've got diesel up, we're going. Now Shunter's back on the road again. Poor little Shunter. Nobody cares for the poor little beast. Do they? Here we go, we're in. Let's park road struggle bus near it, so I'm not struggling with my tools, walking about five mile. They were going down these rollers. <laughs> I'm in the rollers. Where's my Terry? We know which side we've got to do then, don't we? One, two, three. Oil, somebody's been changing engine oils in here, haven't they? Oil barrels are here still, with engine oil everywhere. Just started doing that job, boys. Got a breakdown on there at Northampton. Uh, a brake chain, but well, he thinks it's a brake chain we've got, he's got an air leak on his trailer. So I've chucked a brake chamber in the back here. It's a second hand brake chamber, but it's a good brake chamber. Uh, so we've got about an hour and a half, hour three quarter drive to Northampton. Down A1, across A45, boom, we're at Northampton. We're there on the job, aren't we? So let's see what this job's about. We've got a nice little drive now. We're gonna see some scenery we are. I don't mind a bit of driving. Like, I don't like a lot of driving, mind you, because it gets boring. But I don't mind a bit of driving. On, let's have a clear run, A1. We don't want no hold ups, do we? We bloody don't. Don't hold me up. Struggler on a mission here. No dive eco's on the way. What old dive eco? I know beauty, I know. I know all about it, beauties. I love my little Ivy Co. I know the fucking sheds, boys, I know. But this one's my shed. There are many sheds like it, but this one is mine. It does like to beep at me as well from time to time. Just to let me know it's there still. Just to remind me it's an Ivy Co. Look, just beeps, just on random occasion. Beep. Just to tell me it's an Ivy Co. Look, there you see. What's it coming, mate? Rear door open. Damn it, fucking rear door. Put the air cruise control on. There we go. I must go into these services, aren't I? I must go get some fuel. At the roundabout, take the third exit onto the road towards Northampton. They did have a crumble though. Two pound this was. Isn't it a rob in it? Hmm. Nice one. Lovely bit of crumble. <laughs> oh, I actually love that. Friday night dinner, lovely bit of crumble. Oh, great, lovely bit of crumble. Crumble, crumble. We should be nearly here, I think. After these lights, then it's straight ahead. Should be straight in front of me. Yeah, I haven't seen many nice sights at all on my travels. All I seem to see is run down old farms off the side of the road. There's quite a few around now, you see, don't you? Run down disused farms. He was about to auction them off or whatever. I don't know what the reason is, but you see quite a few of them around now on my travels. Sad to see, innit? You used to see fucking farms jam packed with machinery and all that lot. Right, where is this fucking place? Should be around here somewhere. Oh, I can see the stills, is that it? Fucking hell. If that's it, that's a fucking big place. Breweries always do look old. You know what I mean? Because they've been around for so long, haven't they? But where's the entrance to it? That's the question. I was right to go this way, I was. He's let me through. Can let me go and see the old lad. Here he is. We've found him. Uh, he didn't know whether to couple on it or not because obviously I was repairing it, but uh, I need air on it, don't 
to check which chamber's gone or check that it is a chamber. So he's just going to back under it for me. Yeah, that's it, mate. I'll, uh, while you've got the air still, I'll just wind it off. Yeah, no, we're fine. Because air might be pushing it back a bit, so it'll be easier for me to wind it off. You know what we need here, boys, don't you? The 24 mil ratchet spanner. Aha. And we'll wind the brake up because there's not enough air pressure to take the brakes off. So I'm going to have to wind the brake up manually, take the two parts out, Take the chamber bolts off, take the chamber off. There she is, lot. 24 mil ratchet spanner. Driver, can you just put the part brake on? Just make a note lot of what part goes where. Well. Little pipe at the top, big pipe at the bottom. Because they've got the same fittings on them, you see. So you don't go in the wrong way around. <laughs> Let's go, normal spanner, I can't fit the ratchet on it. Big brewery, mate, this is, isn't it? Yeah. Big huge, isn't it? One of the better ones. The John Smith's ones were all in Tadcaster itself and that was built for awesome car. Still all the pubs in Tadcaster because around with awesome car delivering the barrels. Do they? With the awesome car? Yeah, still just Why is that? Because they can't get with vehicles very good ones. Yeah they can, but it's just tradition. Just tradition. Well the like pubs and a couple of more riders, they do awesome car delivery. That's marvellous, isn't it? Play, yeah. It's good that, isn't it? From the local brewery obviously. Yeah. That's a good bit of fucking info, that, isn't it? A little bit of advertising, mate, for them as well. Yeah, yeah, well, it's good, don't it? Yeah, it comes to the world. Do you see an awesome car going on? We'll have the kegs on it. It's going to raise some eyebrows, isn't it? So you'll think, well, I'll go and have a drink of that beer, isn't it? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Can you uh, take your power brake off? Yes, please. And bang the button, why are they? Yeah, the low valve, that's why that noise is. The low valve, put them down. I think when you take your hand brake off, you'll alright move them to chop and you'll level up. We'll just go and check it right now, come on. Job is a beautiful one, isn't it? What a lovely job that is. Hold on, mate. Yeah, hold on, mate. Yeah, right? Now nah, I'll just get a trailer number. Here is a nice white one. Right, boys, that's the paperwork done anyway. We better go back, hadn't we? We don't want to stay at this brewery all day, do we? Oh, or do we? There's a few kegs to go out here, boys, isn't there? We could have a proper right old do here, couldn't we? Hello, I'm here to taste uh, some beer, please. I'm from the tasters establishment. I've been to a few of these breweries and you often find them right in the middle of city centres and that. I should think it's because back in the day, obviously, where this is situated now was not really that much of a built-up area. It was on the outskirts. But now, obviously, the city has grown around it and the brewery is still here, isn't it? Staying strong. I don't know whether they're struggling, though, nowadays, you know, because these pubs not open and that. Mind you, a lot of people going on to drinking wine and tins, so they still need breweries, don't they? 
Pity though about all the pubs and that, innit? Alright, let's fucking go. Let's make our way out of this establishment. Sat navs took me out one way back. I don't know, whatever the sat nav says. Do whatever the sat nav says. Probably traffic on day one or something, so I don't know. Change of scenery anyway, innit? Yeah, I've just rang our roister up to see if it's, it's worth going back to the yard, but he says, nah, don't bother, boy. You may as well go on now, it's half five now, but it's time to go back to the yard, it's time to fuck off again. So bollocks, we'll go on instead. Isn't it? I didn't realise what the time was, to tell you the truth. Got stuck in that fucking traffic. Sod it, I'm homeward bound. Homeward bound. Here we go, let's go. Here we are. Home sweet home. Right boys, catch you on the next one fellas. See you later. Adios amigos. Adios amigo. I've got all my crap. <laughs>